Hello, IB100 students. I'm coming to you today from the University of Minnesota. I'm actually at this uh, Life Discovery Doing Science conference, learning how to become a better, better educator. Hopefully, I learned some tips and tricks that um, that I can use to help you help you do well in this course. Sorry for any noise. I'm sort of in a public place right now. Um, I'm going to give you a quick overview of the things that you have to do today. So today if you go into the Moodle you'll see you've got lesson one. So this is the introduction to biology and scientific investigation. You'll need to go through this lesson. You'll do a quiz. Uh, you'll have a second lesson, a second quiz, and then a module exam. So hopefully you got started on this uh, earlier. Sorry that this video is a little bit late. Um, I was traveling yesterday. Um, but I'll take you through a lesson just to give you a quick tip. So um, uh, the lessons are pretty self-explanatory. Make sure you read these, go through them carefully, and then you'll do really well on the exams if you take your time as you do the lessons. And you've got these buttons to advance to the next page. You've also got um, you've got a menu here so you can go back and forth through, navigate through the lesson easily. Um, so I'm going to go to I'm going to go to a page that has a question on it. Hopefully, I think this one does, so you can see the difference. Um, most of them just say next page. This one actually says question page. Okay, and so you'll have to select from these menus. The question is up here in the text and then submit your answer and it'll tell you how many attempts you have remaining it'll also give you whether you were uh, right or wrong and give you some explanations so pay attention to that part and then one other tip about lessons when you get all the way down here to the bottom uh, once you've read all the way through the last part of the lesson don't just close the browser you won't get credit make sure that you click on this end of lesson button Okay, so those are just some tips about how to, how to work through the lessons. So let's go back. Um, you've got quizzes. You should be familiar with how to, how to get through a quiz by now. Um, you've done a couple of them. And then you've got this module exam. So um, everything else is open, open book, open internet. Um, when you get to the uh, module exam, though, that's not going to open till 2. It'll be open till 6. You'll be limited to an hour in there. Um, whenever you start. If you don't start before 5, you'll be limited to however much time is left before 6 o'clock. So make sure you get started by 5 o'clock to get that full hour. And uh, one, other, one other bit of info, this lesson, these lessons are not going to be available when you're doing the exam. So make sure you've thoroughly uh, reviewed the lessons. Don't start the exam thinking that you'll be able to go back and review the lessons. You're actually not allowed to. Um, so I think that's it. Uh, hopefully, hopefully things go smoothly today when you're doing your first uh, lessons, your first quizzes, and especially that first exam. Uh, let us know if you have any questions or have any trouble. Um, uh, emails to Ed today would be the best as I am at a conference. Um, but I, I will be paying attention to my emails too. So uh, good luck and uh, hope everything goes smoothly for you.